Oh, platform, platforms gamer, but back where I was on my Blinks 2 Master of Time and Space second um, playthrough um, re redo. Uh, well, actually, yeah, the redo, which is the second playthrough of um, this game. And the, the Time Oil Well world continues for revisit to get the remaining cat medals. One of the cat medals was retrieved, which I got real lucky to be able to uh, save so it didn't fall on, fall on the lava. And the last one is behind those three closed cages in the second mission. I had to get the second player over there in order to take care of the, that business. And then to finish everything up, defeat Silver Claw, and then be able to bank in, bring in those cap medals, and complete the collection. It's a good thing the second player has a time control cartridge that I gave the, um, the sweeper. And I can just save the trouble by going over here uh, perfectly. Okay, it, it requires uh, uh, well, uh, the two record cells and one, uh, one uh, uh, person to get on there, and then the other one has to retrieve the, 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 the metal when those cages open. That takes care of that business, now to get back over there. Whoa, that was close. Two cat medals may have been retrieved, but I better not let my uh, let my guard down for both players. Well, that was close.
At least just like with the with the uh, fl flying vehicle, you didn't have to have the second player go over there too. Hey, Picaro, good timing. All right, Silver Claw's up next. The second player, no doubt, is gonna definitely get hit during the battle. So uh, defeat the Silver Claw as quickly as possible. Who cares about taking damage? All that matters is it's a beating Silver Claw, and then finish up the r the round again. I officially got all 40 cap medals in Blinks 2. I've never been able to do this before on the 2015 playthrough because at the time I did not have a controller that actually worked worked for two player. I'm just so glad that on the redo of this playthrough, I actually was able to get all the cat medals this time. It makes up from all the mistakes I made at, the, at that time at that time ago. Ultimate sweeper unlocked. Just what I was trying to do. There it is, a purplish uh, pink uh, um, sweeper, just like from the first game, except it's it's way less uh, um, than the other one costs. Way less. The other one costed 80,000 gold. This one only costs 5,000 each. We've deciphered. That takes care of... That takes care of all of the cat medals and pig medals in the game.
pretty much that uh, everything important has been completed. The only thing pretty much left to even be able to do is to do the well, talk to Carlos and talk to uh, Jimmy challenges and get all of the, the emblems and un unlock the, um, the, the most uh, best item out of exchanging the emblems. Which, uh, which is a, a picture of Carlos himself on a card, and a picture of Catherine herself on a card, from both sides. I'm not going to spend the emblems uh, uh, from half halfway through, because if because uh, if that happens, then it's impossible to be able to get those uh, those cards. It would be a good way to end this playthrough off by doing those challenges. Although several of them I never liked in the past, so I probably won't get an S rank right away on them in one shot. So I may have to go through a B a a. a a, a, an A rank run before I can be able to get one that actually has an S. So it may be uh, time consuming to do the challenges. The break and match challenges on the ca on the uh, sweeper side for challenges is the most annoying one to try to get an S on. You literally have to destroy every box uh, uh, before the ti time runs out. Otherwise, uh, it's either going to be between a C to an A. To get an S, you need to this, to break get all of them to match before the timer runs out. Really hard to do on break and match part two, but I guess but I will still attempt to do it. Well, that's it for using co-op. This is all I need co-op for. It's just the cat metal. So next time it'll just be one player once again. Although, probably no one is even going to bother to watch this. Anyone who ever does in the future, thanks for watching me get the the cat medals that were in this game. Even the, uh, since I couldn't be able to do it back in the 2015 playthrough uh, um, of, of this and such. Although, I really feel, still feel bad about messing up on the first visit in the pirate's, uh, in the pirate's graveyard with the time sweepers. Like accidentally deleting uh, um, that video I didn't upload yet really uh, um, uh, gave, gave uh, that one a scar, and but it's still this is still better than the first playthrough because I grabbed the pick medals better so I didn't have to go uh, um, go um, back to uh, retrieve them again in those rounds. So the challenges are all that's left: the talk to Jimmy and talk to Carlos. So throughout that, at this point, I will be doing their challenges and try to get S rank on all of them and get unlocked all of those cards, or those photos.